So what is the point here? Emotions are contagious. That's the takeaway. Emotions are contagious. Emotions are passed on from one person to another much faster than any virus. In a matter of seconds, if I'm happy, I'll be transferring that to you. If you are not, you'll be transferring that to me. Have you noticed that we are all still awake? No one fell asleep in the afternoon? And isn't that like a miracle? Honestly, think about it. 2 o'clock in the afternoon, 2.30 is generally the time we put a small nap. No, never. Huh? No. <laughs> One of the reasons is the energy flow from you to me and from me to you. Isn't it? Isn't it? Right? So, energy keeps it going. Emotions are contagious, right? So, watch it. <laughs> so, actually an experiment was done to prove this point. This group of researchers took one group of people uh, to, uh, to a side, right? Got them to jump out of a plane for the first time. And while jumping out of a plane, they had them wear a special suit which had sweat pads on it to collect their sweat. All right? Has anyone here jumped out of a plane for fun? No. Okay, so jumping out of a plane. If you jump out of a plane for the first time, would you be like this? Or would you be more like that? <laughs> right? <laughs> Probably more like this, right? So what they did was they got this guy, jumped out of a plane, collected their sweat. Yeah? And they got another group of people to go to the gym, work out, and collect their sweat as well. So what I've done now, they have the sweat pads from people who jumped out of a plane, people who uh, went to the gym and worked out. Now they got another group of people, divided them in half, sent them for fMRI scan, brain scan. When let's say this group of people went through the machine, you were breathing the sweat, the, 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 the sweat pads were there of the people who went for exercise. And they looked at the brain scan, nothing different, same areas are lit up. Nothing. Normal. When this side was sent through the machine, you had the sweat pads of the guy who jumped through the plane. Now, obviously, when you jump out of a plane for the first time, you're going to get scared, right? There's adrenaline. There's cortisol. All of that, right? What they found was, everyone who went through the machine on this side, the fear center of the brain lit up. The fear center, so there's a part of the brain, when you're scared, that, that gets activated, right? That was activated in all of you. Who knew nothing? You just went for a scan. What had happened? The emotions of this person had been transferred to this crowd through the sweat. So what they realized is emotions are contagious. But we know that on a fundamental level, isn't it? Have you realized on the days that you go home after work when you're not really in a great mood? Okay, let's take a scenario, right? Let me ask you, who of you, of the guys, has ever been asked by your wife Next day, uh, to, to other, when you come home, please bring a loaf of bread with you. Yeah. I'll take Akila, right? right? So Akila now has a hard day at work at Fenton's. Goes home in a bad mood. As soon as he comes to his lovely wife Tanya, asks, Akila, did you bring the bread? <laughs> <laughs> now what happens? What happens? How will Akila respond? Bread? I had a horrible day at work today. You stayed at home the whole day and you asked me for bread. Correct? Of course, then Tanya would say, Oh, I'm so sorry, Akila, for even asking you. Come, please sit down. Right? Let me bring you a cup of tea. Let me take your shoes off. Let me give you a foot massage. Yes, right? Yeah. Right? So if that doesn't happen, I'm thinking you're thinking, like Brindini would do that, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But in reality, what would happen? As soon as Akila says, bread, then Tanya says, the only thing I have to do is bring a loaf of bread. You can't do that also. Right? Now they are arguing, now the child is crying, now the dog is barking, the child, right? right? What has happened? Chaos, right? What has happened? His negative mood has infected everyone in the household. Have you ever... Who has been there, done that? So, learning from this, our moods are contagious. Our moods are contagious.